Warning. If the topic of psychological manipulation and emotional enslavement of women offends you, I want you to stop watching this video. And if you want to continue, you must agree never to use this knowledge to hurt women. Deal? Great. Let's start. Is your wife about to divorce you? Want to stop the divorce from happening, but don't know how? Guess what? You're watching the right video. Here's the thing. Society would have you think that whenever a divorce happens, it's always the man's fault. But here, we know better. The truth is that it doesn't matter what's causing the divorce to happen. What does matter is how you stop the divorce from happening. And here's the great thing about stopping a divorce from happening. It does not take two. It just takes you. And this video will show you how you, on your own, can make your wife change her mind about leaving you. What you'll find here will be different from the typical how to get your wife back advice out there. So remember to take lots of notes. Before we start though, could you help me out? Look underneath this video and click on the like button because you'll really encourage me to make more of these videos for you if you do that. So help me by clicking like. I'll wait here. Done clicking like? Great, let's start now. First of all, understand this. The earlier you follow the advice in this video, the better it will be for you. Once the divorce papers are signed, things get drastically more difficult. So it's super important that you learn this method and act on it quickly. To stop your divorce from happening, you'll only need to take two steps. One, walk away, and then two, get her to fractionate. Now let's talk about the first step, walking away. Here's the ultimate key in understanding relationships. The one who can walk away is the one who has the power in the relationship. In romantic relationships, this fact of human nature is best illustrated in the chase. Look at any relationship, then try to see who's chasing who. And you can bet that the one being chased is the one in control of the relationship they decide where the relationship goes. In your situation, it's your wife who has the control. She holds the cards. She's demanding the divorce. And you're chasing her by trying to change her mind, right? Unfortunately, this is what happens. The more you try to appease her, the more power she gains. So here's the bad news. While she has the power in your relationship, you can't stop the divorce. This means you'll need to change that, and here's how you do it. You'll need to demonstrate your power and impose your will on the relationship. How to do that? You demonstrate your power by walking away. You disappear and cut off all contact with her. How long you'll be away will vary. You might only need a day, or four days, or you might need a couple of weeks. This depends on how bad the situation already is. The point is this. By walking away first, you're wresting control over the relationship from her. And here's what's going to happen. 1. At first, she'll hate you for disappearing. She'll try to call you and send all these nasty texts. She's subconsciously manifesting her resistance to you, wresting power from her. Let her. 2. The longer you cut off contact, the more power you'll steal from her. Wait long enough, and she'll feel powerless enough to calm down and beg you to reply to her. Easy, right? After you've done the first step, then here's the next thing you need to do. The second and final step is to make her fractionate. What does fractionate mean? Don't let that word scare you. Fractionation can be quite simple to use, as long as you know how to use it. It has got roots in hypnotherapy and female psychology. And like any knowledge, it could be used for good or for evil. Indeed, bad men have used it throughout the ages to advance their own manipulative means. But fractionation can also be used for good, like stopping an impending divorce. We'll talk more about fractionation in a short while. If you like this video, then I'd like to invite you to subscribe to my channel. Just scroll down, find the big red subscribe button and click it. Go on, do it. Done subscribing? Great. Now let's continue. Okay, now let's talk about fractionation. With fractionation, you give her intense cycles of alternating positive and negative feelings. 
In short, an emotional roller coaster. The desired results of fractionation are simple to make your woman vulnerable. We'll talk about how fractionation works in a while, but here's what to expect when it's working for you. When a woman fractionates, she'll snap out of her domineering behavior and lose all control of her thoughts and feelings. She'll depend on you for stability, direction, and clarity and become addicted to your power and dominance. And when's all that? Divorce would be the last thing that she wants to happen. Simply because by then she will be emotionally vulnerable and she can only get her emotional fix from you. Sounds great, right? And now it's your turn. In case you didn't catch it, here's the moral of the story. To stop a divorce, you should not try to appease your wife. That doesn't work. What does work, you ask? Two words, mind control. The walk away plus fractionation combo is an example of mind control in action. Here's the deal. If you want to go beyond just the two techniques you've learned in this guide and really master mind control, then I invite you to join Derek Rake's online masterclass on mind control. It was where I learned the fractionation technique and a slew of other mind control techniques that gave me the powers to control and dominate women. I recommend it highly. You'll sign up for the masterclass because it's your best bet to stop a divorce from happening. A link will come up in your video right now. To join the masterclass, click on the link and follow the instructions.